welcome back to Danganronpa V3, where we've learned that Rantara was the ultimate survivor. He apparently got a perk in all of this. And we're about to have another flashback that's probably going to confuse us even more. I just realized his room is a trial scene, or like a class oh, trial. Look at the seats. Yep, sure is. It's happening. F flashback. All right, what do we got now? All right, so last time it was us talking to, I'm assuming, Makoto. Yeah. Yo, Shuichi! I heard you're finally gonna take part in the Gopher Project. Y yeah. <coughs> Are you okay? Are you sure you're not overdoing it? You're the one who's overdoing it. You should be resting at home. You know I can't do that. I don't know how much longer I'll be able to go to school. I won't get any better if I rest anyway. Hope's Peak Academy is working hard to create an antivirus. Even if they do find a cure, the meteorites are still going to be a problem for us. Hey, man, don't look so sad. You're about to go on an Wait. adventure, right? They just said if the virus doesn't kill them, then the meteorites will. Didn't the meteorites cause the virus? Oh, you're right. Or did I misinterpret that? No, I, I'm pretty sure you're right that the meteorites hit and they carried a virus with them. And they just contradicted it. Now that I think about it, 16 boys and girls going on a space trip together. Are you guys gonna do it? Oh. What are you guys talking about? <laughs> All 16 of us. Yeah. Congrats, Shuichi. I heard there are some hot girls there. I told you, don't look so sad. I don't know if I can stand it. I'd have to leave everyone behind. You have to go. I'm begging you. Huh? <laughs> Shuichi, you're our pride, you know that? <coughs> All right, dude, you need to go home. Yeah, you know, take a sick day. Yeah, you have to do it for us. We're leaving everything to you. They seem remarkably calm, too, about the fact that they're all staying here to die. If things get too yeah. rough, then just remember all the fun times we had together. So don't give up. You're our hope. Hmm. I'm everyone's. Were we sent to space to stop the meteorites? Well, no, because remember, they've already. Uh, not according to them. Hmm. Ugh, that memory. Uh, why did I have to remember my friends now of all times? Uh, um... This is Monokuma's doing. He made us remember this. But why? Why make us remember that? That memory is no cause for despair. Right. That, that's right. There's no way we can give up. I promise I'd do my best for them. <sighs> then there's no way I can give up. Okay. So we're looking for the other part of our entire survivor, survivor perk, right? Leave it to me. I'll check every nook and cranny of this room with my magic, of course. <gasps> nope, it's not here. Breathing hard, Himiko ran off. What does all this mean? What are lies? What is the truth? Cool. Um. All right. Where do you think house? it is? I think it's in the basement. I I think because the basement or the dorm. I oh wait Oop. oh shoot. Uh, there's no time to be standing around. We only have till dawn to investigate. I need to expect inspect every inch, get as many clues as I can. That's true. I should go there next. Yep. If Kibo destroys the door like last time, I should be able to get in there. Yep. So head down to the, the library. Oh oh, I Luigi. Ah, Luigi, I finally found you. Huh? Smoogie, what's wrong? Um, um, I was checking Kaito's research lab up on the sixth floor, but... What is this? Kibo's attack demolished a room with the school and caused a new room to appear. Um, I'm actually not interested. I want to go down to the basement. Uh, the um, new room. Yeah. yeah, and it's a really weird room, too. Anyway, come with me. Just when we were about to head downstairs. Coincidence. Smoogie spoke almost encouragingly, then walked on ahead. I'm assuming we're going to need her anyways, because we need yeah. three, so. A weird room, huh? I can't ignore that. I suppose I have no choice. I'll go there later and head to the sixth floor right now. No. Nope. Not where I want to go, game. Don't remember how to get to his lab. Isn't there a door right there? Can you go? Oh, that's our lab. That's our lab. Just, I don't know my way around the school. Well, we want to go up, so there's got to be stairs somewhere around here. Or was his? No, that's Kibo's that I was thinking of. Who's are we looking for? We're looking for Kaito. 
That's a uh, cosplay. Oh my god, I don't remember where his lab is. I'm assuming it won't let you check the map. No, that's the thing. Like, I I completely understand not letting us warp around because that's that's kind of the point. But I was it even in the school? I don't remember. That's a, that's the really frustrating thing is if I, I could at least see the actual map. Oh, I, I know where it is. It's by Himiko's lab. It's that door we blew out. That was the black and white checkered door. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah, it's, honestly, it's a little frustrating that to not even be able to look at the map in, in this situation. I think, it's a, I think that's a, like way. unnecessarily harsh. I mean, I guess maybe it's a sign of like how how much you paid attention to the layout of the school, but still. Some of those places you've only been once. Right. Alright, gotta 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 book it, Shuichi. Gotta want it. Uh, oh. Oh, there. there just seems like there's so many other places you need to go with the time limit left. Jeez. Jeez. <laughs> Hello. Leave it there to me, go. everyone. <laughs> go, man, go. There's no it. time to. There's no time to turn the camera. We just gotta go. This was it, right? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Good job. Oh, there okay. There we go. Yes, suspiciously timed Samugi. Oh, mm -hmm. is this where we were all in cryo or whatever uh, they're gonna call it? A new room. It must be it that. Like, right. This room's really weird, isn't it? I can't figure it out. Okay. I'll try looking around. I went through the large hole in the wall and stepped into the next room. Cold, Cold sleep room. room. Okay. Yeah. Uh, um. Th this is. Hey, right. This room's really weird, isn't it? I can't figure it out. Could it be? I suppose it's possible that. Oh boy. Uh, here we go. Uh, another. What is it this time? I wonder if that like room in the basement is like the last room it lets you look at and it's only if you have enough time. But it's weird because you need the truth bolts to do the class trial, so I don't know. Or do they just add the time limit to add a element? Yeah. Wait, wait. Oh, look, it's everybody in the well, room. Then. Oh. Let's begin then. Wait! Hold on, I'm not mentally ready yet. <laughs> well, robots probably don't need to mentally prep themselves the way humans do. Oh? Actually, do robots even need to be put in cold sleep? That's robophobic. I'm still a teenager, just like all of you. I would feel lonely if I were the only one still awake. Like I thought. But it's really okay. This won't be my first time in cold sleep, so I'm just plain nervous. <laughs> mm, it's the same for all of us. <laughs> but you know, it's a man's dream to leave Earth behind and travel across the stars. Ew. What a careless guy. Fucking moron! Oh, fucking idiot is more like it. What? Hey, who are you calling an idiot? Oh, uh, jeez. Okay, break it off. We gotta be friends here, so don't start fighting with each other. Uh -oh. uh, friends, you say? Yeah, that's right. That's right. We're friends from here on out. Uh, even though you just met us and don't e know what we're like? Because while well, the 16 of us are going to be here together from now on. Yeah. It might be hard, but let's try to take it one step at a time. We might fight at first, but we shouldn't forget about believing in each other. Yeah, that's right. We all went through some such a difficult time, so I think we can all become good friends. Right? What do you say? Mm. Going to agree. Going to want to be friends with everyone. That is correct. After we wake up from cold 
sleep, we'll have no choice but to live together. That's right. So we better get, all get along. Yeah! Yeah, we're already friends. Even Atua says that we're all friends. <gasps> <gasps> this episode has been brought to you by Atua. Yes, it's been so long. Yeah, that sounds like a pain, but okay, I guess. Hey. Hey, what about you? Huh? Huh? M me? Uh, okay. Uh, yeah, of course. Mm -hmm. I see, I'm glad. Huh. No matter how many times we fight, we smile in the end. That's what true friendship is. It'd be cool if, if we could be like that, all 16 That's of us. That's right! Yes, I agree. As long as we leave the degenerate males out. <laughs> I, um, I think us guys should be included too. All right! Then let's do it. It'll probably be a couple of years before we see each other again. Let's all work together and do our best. That's right. Yes, because we are humanity's last hope. All right! All right. Let's all get some shut eye. I'll see you guys later. A little oh. memory. Uh, 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 I remember now. This room is. It can't be. This was the room where we all went into cold sleep. Then. Smooky, you remember too. Okay. This is the room where we were put into cold sleep for the Gopher Project. It's where the 16 of us first met. But. But back then, we all said we'd work together. We promised we'd become friends. <laughs> now we're killing each other. Why did it have to end up like this? That's... This is Monokuma's fault. Monokuma and the true mastermind controlling him. Um... That real mastermind hiding in this academy is making us do all this, right? Right? Hey, Suichi, let's find them no matter what and end this killing game for good. Um, and then, let's finally fulfill that promise we all made. There's a lot of us missing now, but it's not too late. You're right. Yeah, you're right. What's the book? There's some documents left on the table. Huh? The Gopher Project Participants List. Um, mm -hmm. Oh yeah, I wanted you to take a look at this. I found it when I was here earlier. Uh, um, Anything in particular um, note? All our files are written here. Most of the stuff we already know, but that's not the important part. It's about Kaede. Huh? What about Kaede? Seems like she has a twin. Wait, I've played this game before. Huh? A twin? Yeah. Mukuro Ikusap. She wasn't a twin. <laughs> yeah, it seems like she has a younger twin sister. It said her sister was adopted by a relative and they barely had any contact, but... Uh... I'm still a little worried because Junko and Oshima had a twin sister. Oh, they uh, were twins. Okay. Yeah. Mukuro and her. I forgot yeah. that. Yeah, true, but... That reminds me! On top of that, Junko used her twin sister to run her killing game from behind the scenes. Ah. Oh. I mean, it's probably just a coincidence, but I thought I should mention it to you, Suichi. Thank you. Yes, thank you. That would be annoying if they did the same trope. I don't think they're going to. No. I'm, I'm calling red herring right here. This is the first time I'm hearing that Kaede has a twin. But is that relevant? Are you the twin, Samuki? That would be interesting. <laughs> I don't- I don't think the twin- I'm- I'm have a feeling that's a red herring. It doesn't really matter, does it? It seems like- that seems like too convenient. Although they have- I mean, they've played off similar themes, so I'm not- I'm like 85% ruling it out. Like, seems like their battle has gotten more intense. I wonder if we're gonna be okay. It seems like the building is going to break soon. If I remember correctly- Kibo said he'd give us until dawn, but- But, but there's a chance that Monokuma will defeat Kibo right before that, right? Okay. Either way, we should hurry. What should we do? What are we gonna do now? I'm... There's a place we should investigate. I found it right after the killing game started, but it's been closed this whole time. Maybe. You mean... Okay. Yes, the hidden room in the back of the library. With Kibo's help, I'm positive I can get inside. Certainly. Oh, you're right. I'll go with you. Mmm... Yeah. Alright. To the library. Okay, hopefully... In the basement. Someone else interrupts us. That's really suspicious. The only one left is Kibo. Right. That's what I'm saying. Which, didn't we... It's like kind of confirmed that he, he was helping Monokuma in some way, or was like affiliated. Who? Kibo. Because it sounded like... Or... Or his inner voice sounds like it was doing good things. So now is he more evil? Or wasn't allowed to do anything outside his programming with that? Once I wonder if he was programmed in a specific way. I wonder if he was used to keep an eye on things. And like report back to Monokuma. I hear footsteps. Is there an Exisil out here? Yes. Nope. Alright. Alright, that's the 
staircase Let's up, go. so we need to go across. Let's do this! Uh, oh, you again. Um, I, I mean, there's been no variety. Well, Leave we had me, everyone. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Good Monosuke for a little bit. Yeah. But Monodom has it out for us. There we go. Monodom is actually the mastermind. That'd be amazing. Uh, hello? That's the game room. There you go, Larry. Here we go. I don't know if I like being in the basement with this place coming down around yeah, us. Yeah, this seems like the least safe place to be. Well, or maybe it's the most. Oh, look, everyone's down here now. Mucky. <laughs> I knew you would come here. If you're reinvestigating old areas, you'd have to come here eventually. Okay. But before you do, listen to what I have to say. Oh, blueprints. Okay. Is it about the blueprints? Have you looked through okay. all of them? Yeah, I have, but something caught my eye that worried me. Although I'm not sure how significant it is. Give it. Wait, no. Tell me. There's so many things to investigate. I don't have time to be distracted by, by what? Maki. What? Um. Hey, Maki. What was in all those blueprints you were looking through? Okay. I found a design that worried me a little. It was drawn with too much detail. <laughs> uh, um. It looks like a vacuum. What a peculiar shape. Weirdo. It's a machine that sucks up bugs called the bug vac. Huh? A bug vac. Uh, well, Kichi came up with the design, but I thought there weren't any bugs outside of Gonta's lab. No. Now that you mention it. He said there was no bugs here. Not because of ki tiny bugs. Don't you think he's like a tiny bug? Okay. Remember. Gonta was always seeing small what? bugs. But Gonta said he was just seeing things. Oh, yeah. Maybe Kokichi asked me to invent that to see for himself. Huh? So Mew actually made this. Okay. After I found this design, I went to Mew's research lab. This is interesting. Well... I found a prototype that she was still working on. Hey. This is it. It may be a prototype, but it seems to be functioning already. The suction function is already finished. As she said that, Maki flipped the switch on the machine and... It has pretty strong suction. With this, you can vacuum up all the bugs around you at once. But... Hmm, nothing in it. Know. Looks like it was used several times, but it doesn't seem like they caught any. Maki side turned off the bug catcher. I see. Then does that mean there are no bugs? It was just going to his imagination after all? Okay. That's probably the case. I really want to see how this bug thing factors into mm. all this. Well, even if there were bugs, I don't know how that would be a clue. Sure. Whatever. I want to tell you, especially since I spent a lot of time investigating it. Uh, okay. R right. Thank you. Were those bugs really just going to his imagination? There must be more to it than that. Ah, you guys were here. Yeah, if we're all gonna meet up, then why didn't anyone tell me? I couldn't find anyone, so I started gonna get worried. Uh, um... Ugh, sorry. Hey. Where were you up to until now? Hey! You went to Rantaro's room, right? Did you find anything interesting? <sighs> what is this expression? Here we go. What you got? Um... Hey, Himiko, did you find anything in Rantaro's room? Shut up! I'm not gonna tell you. Stop asking me. Shut up. Leave me alone. Huh? Huh? Why? If I say I didn't find anything, you're gonna decide I'm useless, aren't you? I won't let that happen. So I guess you didn't find anything. It's okay. Don't worry. I wasn't expecting anything from you anyway. Ouch. What did you say? That's just as bad. If it isn't in Rantaro's room, then where is his survivor in perk? that vault. <laughs> we didn't find anything on his body. Did he hide it somewhere before he died? But hiding it in your room would be the safest place for it. No, it isn't. Did someone take what's it? Wrong? So you're right. What's wrong? Hey, we're going to check what's behind the hidden door, right? Let's hurry and do it. You're right. Y yeah, you're right. All right, let's do it. Hmm. Let's do it. The hidden doors where Rantaro was investigating just before he died. There might be something in there that would be a valuable clue. First, I should inspect the hidden door. Do it, do it, do it, do it. 
No, hold on. We haven't talked to Samugi. No, I don't care about Samugi. All right. <laughs> Hey, we're gonna check see what's behind the hidden door, right? Let's hurry and do it. Oh. See, even she doesn't care about Samugi. <laughs> Samugi doesn't care about Samugi. <laughs> hidden door is revealed when the bookcase swings open. The door has been locked this entire time. Hat foot. But I think Kokichi had a key card. With Kibo's help, we might be able to open um, it. This door can only be opened with a key card. There must be something here. <laughs> Maybe the mastermind's hiding behind this hidden door. That's true. Then if we kill them, we can end this killing game. No. No, I told you, we can't kill them. If you do that, we'd be the same. <laughs> Whoa. Huh? Uh. Found you! You oh. guys have been doing whatever you feel like, huh? We were well, looking for you. Well, yeah, You kinda. can't just go anywhere you want without permission. Father will get mad. I yeah. don't like it when father gets mad. So before he finds out about this, Kibo. I'm gonna destroy you all! Kibo. Damn it! Everyone run! No, Kibo. There we go. Ah, I can't move! Just Aww. stay put for now. Ah! Kibo, you saved us. His reward I'll use my magic <laughs> to turn you into a real boy. So you need me to open the, that door, right? Uh, Okay. Y yes, please. Hey! Are you ignoring me? Well, I guess there's nothing I can do since I need to charge my... Listen closely. Please stand back. It's dangerous to be too close. After that terse comment, Kibo aimed his rocket launcher at the door. So his inner voice, I think, was what was keeping him from installing all those upgrades. Uh. Now we have them. <laughs> The hidden door is completely destroyed. Yes. The door is open. We can finally yeah. enter. The, the mastermind's hiding in there, no doubt about it. But is it okay to just go in there? What if we get attacked or something? But no, never mind. I guess I was like, maybe we cause damage to the inside. Okay. Then we'll just have to strike back. Yeah, I, we have Maki. <laughs> I would join you, but I need to hold off the exosils here. Thanks, Kibo. Well then, Shuichi, it's all up to you. Please catch the mastermind, no matter what. Uh, Okay. Okay, got it. Go, oh, man. The mastermind is in here? No. No. That certainly is possible. We should be careful. Then. All right, let's go. Oh, shoot. We should have talked to well, everybody. I'll go first. I'm the only one who can fight if anything happens. I guess. Oh, yeah, please. I miss having Gonta. Led by Maki, we walk through the hidden door. Uh, a lot of hearts on the wall. This is not what I was expecting. This is a this is a hidden room. It's much bigger than I expected. Wait, this room's atmosphere. Seems like. Doesn't it remind you of the remnants of despair that admire Junko and Oshima? I knew it. Mastermind behind this killing game must be hiding in here. Why you? Me where? Where's the mastermind hiding? <laughs> here. Huh? What is it? Was that Monokuma's voice just now? Yahoo! Welcome to the final stage. Guess it's time for the final boss to make their debut. What? Where? Where's that voice coming from? Ma is there a monitor in here? I think it's behind the curtain. Oh. Wait! <gasps> Wait, what? Oh! Draped in fabric. It looks suspicious. I cautiously lifted up the fabric and hopefully we still get to look around the room. Did you see a Monokuma? No, I see a, something with blood on it. Oh. Well, hopefully we'll get to look around the room, I would think. A Monokuma head. <laughs> you found me. Or rather, you just found a place that you were meant that you were meant to find. At any rate, you can't end the killing game. The Killing Game was born from the womb of despair. Starting with the Killing Game at Hope's Peak Academy created by the ultimate despair. <laughs> They're all connected. The Killing Game is despair itself. Is Monokuma controlling Monokuma? <laughs> oh, that'd be cool. <laughs> so wait, wait, wait. Have there been more Killing Games? Makes it sound like it. 
They want me to see. Oh, that's interesting. But what is this? Ah, okay. Okay, so we can look around. I have a feeling it's probably <gasps> monopad. No way! Ah, talk to me first. Finally, it's my turn. I'm so excited to tell you everything. I want to know what that is. Yeah, all right. Hey! Are you Monokuma? Hey, um... Of course, but I'm not just any Monokuma. <laughs> I'm the overseer of the killing game and the source of all Monokumas. <laughs> It's Mother Kuma. Mother Kuma. <laughs> <laughs> Even the jar. Mate, that's awesome. So I've been given a special name, Mother Kuma. Mother Kuma. Then. So then, the machine that makes spare Monokumas in this academy. Yeah? Oh, that's me. Here. You see this amazing machine behind me? It creates spare Monokumas. All I gotta do is copy over my thoughts and. Yahoo! Presto, I give birth to myself. What is that? A spare monokuma can be made that easily? I thought they were advanced robots. No way! Uh, yeah, that's why I'm so amazing. No. No, that might be a lie. It's trying to trick us with fake information. That's true. Anyone can see this thing is giving too much information far too conveniently. No way! Huh? But it's not a lie. I can make spares really easily. That's true. Could you do it right what? now? Yeah, try and make a new monokuma. Huh? Oh, what's wrong? What? I can't birth the Monokuma for someone who doesn't love me. <laughs> what about after it's born, huh? Did you think about that? Take some responsibility. Cut it out. Whatever, just give birth to a Monokuma. Birth refused. No, I won't do it. I'm not gonna birth one for someone I don't like just because they tell me to. This is stupid. Hurry up and just give birth to Monokuma. Hey. Are you listening? We said give birth to a new Monokuma. Hey now. Totally ignoring us. I wonder if the thing about the spears was a lie after all. A lie, huh? But why lie about that? There has to be some motivation to lie. Well, probably so we wouldn't just try to destroy my Nakumas. Hey. hey. Enough with the Monokuma. Let's hurry and search this room. You're right. You're right. The Mastermind is hiding here somewhere. Hey, Shuichi. Shuichi, don't you stand around. Look for the Mastermind. Um, okay. Yeah. He's not here, or she. That's right. First, we have to see if the Mastermind is hiding here, which I'm going to say no. Not hiding, anyway. There should be other clues here as well. All right, we'll just have to... The Mastermind's in the trash can. We'll check for the Mastermind in the trash can in the next episode. So, man, I was not expecting that the Mother Kuma. That thing's nope. neat. That was a cool reference. Uh, anyway, that's going to do it for us. As always, thank you guys so much for watching, and we'll see you next time.